Welcome back. 846 now your time. The Michigan Science Center is making learning fun for kids around the country. While the coronavirus has classes closed, the Science Center is doing some fun daily experiments online. Joining us live via Skype is Anna Sterner. Uh, and she is a science educator. Good morning to you. I love this idea and I like watching right along with my daughter. Oh, thank you so much, Amy. We're so glad you guys are tuning in. Um, the Michigan Science Center is putting on free daily science programs every day over our Facebook Live. Um, so I brought some demos to show off today um, if you'd like to see them here. We definitely will. Let me ask you a few questions real quick and then we'll get to the experiment. Um, why is it so important that kids stay engaged with science during this time? You know, this was unexpected for everyone. I think teachers are looking for online resources and kids who love science might be missing that class at school. Um, I know science was one of my favorite topics and I was always interested in doing science at home even after school hours. And so we really want to be that resource for teachers and for parents and for students who just really love science experiences. Um, they can get that from us every single day for free. Science was my all-time favorite class. Uh, it's also good because they're going to be on their electronics anyway. At least they are learning something in the process. Yeah, absolutely. We've gotten a pretty awesome response that this is, you know, easy for parents to kind of have their kids sit down for something that they already enjoy doing. Um, I'm getting to try some of my favorite things that I've seen on YouTube. I'm showing off the biggest and best experiments that I know how to do, um, and I'm learning new things every day. So I hope the audience at home is too. What do you have for us today? Let's get to the experiments. Well, fire is one of our most requested topics. I know how much you guys enjoy when we bring fire demonstrations to the studio. So I figured we'd show one off um, right here in our Echo Distance Learning Studio today. So I brought with me our whoosh bottle demonstration. So I have um, an empty water jug here that I'm going to pour in um, another ingredient. So in this beaker here, I have some ethanol. Ethanol is an alcohol, just like the alcohol we find in hand sanitizer. Um, but this stuff, in order to light it on fire, we actually are looking to create some vapor. So I'm gonna take this and actually swirl it around inside the jug, creating um, some evaporation. So that liquid is turning into a gas, which will be much easier to ignite or light on fire. Um, but since we'll be doing a fire demonstration, we always want to practice good lab safety. So I do have with me my fire extinguisher, and I'll also be putting on my safety goggles and a pair of gloves um, just so that we're being extra safe um, right here in the studio. So I've got my gloves, got my safety goggles, and then we'll go ahead and we'll be igniting our whoosh bottle here. So today on Echo Live at 2.30 p.m., we'll be talking all about combustion reactions. So basically fire. Um, and so if you enjoy this, you should tune back in at 2.30 today. Um, here we go with the whoosh bottle in three, two, one. <laughs> Oh my goodness. So we've been talking a little bit about vacuums on Echo Live this week as well. So as we burn away that oxygen from our reaction here, if you kind of seal the top, uh, we actually create a vacuum as we run out of oxygen inside the jug. Very cool. I love it. And I know uh, the kids at home love watching that kind of things. That's definitely not one of the things they want to try at home, but there are some fun oh, definitely things. Definitely not. not. Definitely not. But uh, there's always some things that kids can do. Uh, they can always make slime. What are some other at home fun experiments that you can suggest? Yeah, if you tuned in yesterday, we showed off a pretty fun vacuum demonstration that kids can actually try at home safely with some parent supervision. So we'll be suggesting these types of things every day online. Um, we'll be suggesting activities that relate to the science they learn because we really want to keep the learning going. And it's only because of our generous sponsors like the DT Energy Foundation that we're able to do these programs every day. So we are very thankful to them. Um, we know that people are really enjoying the programs. We've seen such an incredible response. Um, and so we're really excited to keep bringing to these um, out to the public every single day. And we are so thankful that you are doing it. Just love uh, watching myself with my 10 year old. Uh, very entertaining at a time when we can all use the distraction. And great to see you this morning. Once again, where can we find this on Facebook, right? So if you'd like to tune in to Echo Live, it happens every day at 2.30 p.m. Eastern, um, and it is live cast over the Michigan Science Center Facebook page. Great, thank you so much. We'll be tuning in today. Have a great weekend. See you later, Amy. <laughs>